Yo, this is Eternal Plays, The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. Look guys, look. Pendant of Courage, Pendant of Power, Pendant of Wisdom. We have them all! We have them all. Now, we are ready to go to the Lost Woods to collect the Master Sword. To become mighty, powerful, strong, and be able to defeat the evil sorcerer, Agni. Let's go. We've already been in this part before. We got ourselves our heart piece, and we also got ourselves the uh, magical mushroom, which we needed to. Um... Oh, look at this! For one hundred rupees, I let you open one chest and keep the treasure that's inside. What will you do? Uh, let's open the chest. I mean, we only have a lot of rupees. Let's see. Left, middle, right. Let's go for the middle one. A uh, rupee. Wow. We can't open many more chests, the game is over. Yes, yeah, so I think one of the chests is 50 rupees, another one is like 200 rupees. It's a bit of a gambling game, but yeah, we just flunked it completely. Too bad though. It's the Master Sword, guys, we got it! This is it, the Master Sword! No, this can't be it. Too bad. Yeah, it's just a cup. Hey, at least you can use it for something before it vanished. So this is the place we can get the um, heart piece, you just you get it, you just slash up in here. You drop down to get the piece of heart. And if you haven't gotten the magical mushroom yet, you will be finding it here, just slash up in these things and collect it here. And then you're able to bring it back to the magic potion shop and you'll be able to get yourself being able to purchase some more magic potions, of course, as the blue potion, which restores both health and uh, magic. Of course, it will be more expensive, but hey, we worth it, right? Can't even reach that thing. Too bad. Oh well. Now, if you've all been all through everything here, no, that's not the must sword right there. Go down here. You can probably get to it if you want to. Careful, that thief! Though he will steal your things. Get ready, go up here, and get ready yourself, time to become mighty. The animals flung around, and there it is. Can't even read what it says. Okay. Book of Madura, I call you. The hero's triumph of Cataclysm's Eve wins three symbols of virtue. The master sword he will then retrieve, keeping the knight's line true. So, here we have it. Let's double check. The first pendant was here, Eastern Palace. Then you traveled south, down here to southwest, to Desert Palace. Then we traveled all the way north, up here, for another pendant. When you have them all, you end up right here. Where the Master Sword is and where we are right now. The Master Sword is right ahead of us. We can't open it without a pendants, but now we have them. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the most epic scene in Legends of the Link to the Past the Awakening of the Master Sword. I love this. The pendants are there, they're shimmering. The sword is glimmering. And. It's out! Suddenly, Saraza contacts you telepathically. Link, it is extraordinary that you won the Master Sword that makes evil retreat. With this shining sword, I believe you can deflect the wizard's evil powers. The destiny of this land is in your hands. Please, Link. And now, even the Lost Woods change completely, and if you swing your sword, check this out. Yeah. This sword sounds different, looks different, and it's more powerful. Longer range as well is pretty cool. Check on the screen as well, this is now sword level 2. Awesome. Now this sword is cool though, you remember those blue guards that take uh, 3 hits to kill? Now we only do it twice. The green guards that took 2 hits to kill? 
Don't worry, you only need one hit now. We can take it down in a single hit. We are really strong and powerful now. And with this, we can battle Aghanim and defeat him to rescue everything. Here, that's Zelda. We're coming for Aghanim. We're gonna kill him, and then you can go, go free. Oh, it was that easy. Well, he has a backup plan, too. Link, help! The soldiers are coming to Sanctuary! Ah! Uh-oh. As you can see, the mist have cleared off from the Lost Woods, but now things have become really bad, so apparently... Apparently, the soldiers of uh, Hyrule res responding under orders from... Uh, from Ganondorf, now they have gotten themselves to go to Sanctuary, where the uh, priest and Zelda is, and now he seems like to be being attacked. This is bad. Map now you can see there's a skull mark on the Hyrule Castle. That's probably a very bad thing. I don't even know why it is, though, because on the Hyrule Castle, that's where Aghanim is. We're gonna go and defeat him, but before we can go there, we have now to go to the Sanctuary. Or should we say even the cathedral? I can't really want to say it. You can't kill still these things here with um, with the master sword, sadly. So we still have to do this. That's fine, though. See this green thing here now? Look now. One hit. Much easier now to do things because now they just die in a single hit. Ouch! Bomb still hurt. Oh boy. They're still chopping that thing. You don't have anything else to do. You still brothers. Let's see, just, let's see if we get in some hearts here. For money though, at least. Let's kill this thing here. Just jump down. Ow, 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 ow. Birdies! They're persistent. There we go. It's a bit annoying to fight one, if not fighting two at the same time. That's just painful. Hey, green guard. Yeah. One hit KO on this one. I love it. We've been there before. There's some more guards. I guess they're guarding the sanctuary from our entrance. More money, at least. I mean, who will throw a rupee in the bush? Or even worse, who will have a guard hide in the bush? So I'll show you guys some. Oh, wow, there's a mine there! Or a bomb beam. Let's go inside and see what's happening. Uh, Zelda's gone and the priest is on the floor. Sleeping or what? Link, you are a second too late. I have failed. Zelda, the soldiers have abducted her. They have taken her to the castle. You must find her before the wizard works his magic. Please, you are our only hope. Wow, the priest died! And Zelda's been abducted to Hyrule Castle. Yeah. Now don't worry about thinking that, oh no, if I'd only done this fa faster, I would have been able to do it. No, you are supposed to have Zelda being kidnapped. Sadly. Ouch! Stay away from me, you freak. Now, we should go to Hyrule Castle right now in order to get to Zelda. But, you can also do a little other thing first. You see, when we were at Death Mountain earlier, we had something cool. Oh, yeah, I need to show you guys something. With the Master Sword, now you get a new technique. Which can only a a a appear once you have full hearts. What does it do? See this? Like a blade beam. Every time 
this blade beam thing. Yeah. Every time you have full health with the Master Sword, you can throw a blade beam. They beam has the same power as the old swords, you still have to hit, uh, let's say, the blue soldier three times and the green soldier twice. Pretty nice, though. No wonder, why am I going back to Death Mountain again? It's because, yes, we should go and rescue Zelda for sure. Before we do that, though, we're going to collect another item, which we can only collect after we got the Master Sword. You don't need to collect it now, because you, you will need it later, but you don't need to get it now, but, eh, might as well. Let's go down here. This is where we were when we were with the old guy. Ouch. So it's qu as, as soon as we lost that uh, health of ours, then we're no longer able to use the blade beam, so be careful. here, try to dodge these boulders. Easier said than done, of course, because they can sometimes just be very obnoxious. Let's go up here. Then have to do a little trick again with the um, teleporter thing. So just go inside here. And then do the dark world. Still the same dark world as you can see. Let's go up here and use the magic mirror so we can go back to the light world. Now, remember where we were here last time? We were up here and we looked at this uh, thing here and we said something interesting. Well, a lot of sluggish words. This is the Book of Madura. Hold up the Master Sword and you will get the magic of Aether. Well, now we have the magic sword, so... Wow. And now I got the Aether Medallion. Its magic controls the upper atmosphere and polar wind. Watch your magic meter. Yeah, with this, we can start to do a lot of cool tricks. Now, this thing here will be required later on in this game to do something cool and special. So, don't need to worry about it for now. That's basically the only thing we're going to collect for now, so let's just go down to that mountain and I will get to some enemies and I'll show you the power of the Aether Medallion. I will, uh, can use it here as well to show off, but I uh, don't need to, because uh, you need to show off a place where you can actually see. Okay, well, stop a bit, because else you will be flung down this little hole. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna go over a room where we have a little bit more enemies at least. Do you have a place where we got the red guard the blue guard maybe? Nah, screw you. Stupid person-ish thing. Perfect. Now, let's go into the there, the ether, and use it. Check this. Yeah, they turn into ice. What's up, dude? Where's your friend? <laughs> wow! I just picked up his friend who is completely frozen in ice because of the Ether Medallion. And I just threw it at the other enemy and it just vanquished. Now, what if I did something even more evil? Hey, take a bath. That doesn't work. Why don't we just kill him? Bit of a cool move to do. A bit of a evil move maybe to do, but hey, it works. As you can see, there's more soldiers throwing bombs as well. We haven't seen these enemies here before. These are new ones. Which probably means that Agnim now knows that we are here. The red ones here are a bit chaotic. You can see, yeah, they hit him three times. The red ones are basically even stronger than the blue ones. They take three hits with the Master Sword, which means they take four hits with the regular one. They like to throw spears instead, so they're pretty easy. Next down here, can't even hurt you. 
pretty easy to do it. Oh boy, now we went getting into the go front of the gate here. Killing both of them in a single hit because that's what you do. Now, people, it's time to return to the Hyrule Castle, but this time I'm not gonna rescue a princess from the dungeons below. No, we're gonna go further up. Because most likely the princess is up in Aghanim's chambers to be ready to be sent away. We can't allow that, we have to stop him, and we will. Or at least we will die trying. Sure. Like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on social media. That's great for now. See you guys next time as my journey. Legend of Zelda Link to the Past continues.